Welcome to Aperture Laboratories. What's up guys, Rupdad here and welcome back to Let's Play Portal. I know, it's a short series going by really fast, but... To tell you the honest truth, there's a reason I'm doing Portal. And no, it's not just because I want to get a third game... A third LP under my belt before moving forward, just to say I got three LPs done this year. No, the honest reason is... I'm just gonna reveal to you now, I do have future plans to do a Let's Play of Portal 2, and perhaps move on to a series relating to Portal 2 custom maps beyond there. But, I want, like doing things in order, and I figured, if I'm gonna do Portal 2, I might as well do Portal first, it's only fair. So, anyway, onward we press to our next chest chamber, test chamber 8. Please know that we have added a consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. Of course she's referring to the green slime poison stuff that is now... I, don't know, I honestly don't know exactly what it is. I don't know if it's supposed to be acid or what. It kind of looks like sewage, honestly. Okay, so let's go ahead and put a portal over there. Oh, that didn't work out nearly as well as I thought it would. Okay, uh... Let's get a portal away from that. And let's head out over here. I need to dodge that energy pellet. Because that will kill me. Okay, and... Oh, it's gonna fly right over my head. Nice. Now... Where the hell do I need to take this thing? Oh, this isn't going to end well. Think, 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 think. Okay, I'm over here now. And... Okay, now things have gotten considerably more challenging. And now it's a matter of me trying to remember exactly where the hell I'm supposed to send this damn thing. Where I need to position my portals. Okay, now I've gotten a loop. Alright, there we go, there we go. We got it. Okay, it took me a moment there. Like I said, I have beaten this game before, and most of the portal game puzzles are now, uh... Very impressive. Please note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. Right. That's supposed to enhance my testing experience. It, it's even got smoke coming out of it. That cannot be healthy. Anyway. Like I said, well I have played this game before, and most of the portal puzzles are kind of just locked somewhere in the back of my brain. It's been a long time since I played the first portal, so I may get stumped for a few moments on some of these test chambers. Okay, we're on to test chamber 9. We're already four minutes into this video, about, and I'm only on the second test chamber I'm trying to put into this video, so this is going to be interesting. The Enrichment Center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. Oh, really? Well, let's see. Well, considering the fact that we have an emancipation grill here... The Enrichment Center apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. Clearly broken my ass. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. 
We're gonna put you there. Then head through here. And now let's retrieve the cube. I said retrieve the cube. Once again, the enrichment center. Impossible, huh? Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. Right. I'm going. Alright, two chambers down, two to go for this video. Alright, Gladys, what's next? I'm trying to remember which chamber it is. I get the other portal gun, too, so I can get control of both portals and use them on my own. Because we're roughly about halfway through the game at this point. As sad as that might be to admit. Hello again. Hello. To reiterate, yes. Previous one. Yes. Yes. All I got out of this forward momentum, but that is exactly what she's talking about. We need to be able to fly through there so we can actually get onto the stairs. Cause Chell is apparently Chell doesn't have hops. She's not Mario, after all. Okay, so in that instance, let's jump, and there we go. Now, on to the actual test. Woo. Take a while, guess what we have to do? Jump, and fly. Spectacular. You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. Okay, so that's gonna move out now, and... Do we get a portal on there? No, we do not. Ah, I remember this one now. Okay, so what I'm looking to do here is I'm pretty sure I need to go off the top one. And then... Geronimo! Momentum. A function of mass and velocity is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. Speedy thing goes in, speedy thing goes out. Yes, Gladys. I do understand that. So let's try this again. Whoa, like I said before, the camera doesn't always cooperate. Sometimes it tends to do that when you're flying through the portal at an awkward angle. Well, if it reads it as an awkward angle anyway. And they have to cut off the creepy sound. Whatever, I don't mind. Whatever gets us on to the next test chamber. Okay. I believe this is test chamber 11, if I've been keeping track correctly. The Enrichment Center promises to always provide a safe testing environment. In dangerous testing environments, the Enrichment Center promises to always provide useful advice. For instance, the floor here will kill you. Try to avoid it. Gee, thanks. And there is our other portal gun! So we just need to get down there and grab that. And this is test chamber 11, so this is going to be the last chamber for this video. Longest video in the series yet. Okay, so I'm just going to put a portal here and see... Oh, I'm not going through there. Go ahead, fire your portal. Okay, that one works out a hell of a lot better. So, just gonna press the X button to use this button. Okay. Got a. Sorry about that. Controller slipped out of my hand and out of my foot. My apologies. Okay, so now we have a portal here, so we can head up here now. Whoa! 
I do not like the look of that. Let's get a portal here and see where I can send this thing. Exactly where it needs to go. But now I need to get out of here. Portal here. Okay, back on solid ground. Yep. Alright, Portal Gun, you are mine. Just as soon as this thing gets over there. so that it can now manufacture two linked portals at once. As part of an optional test protocol, we are pleased to present an amusing fact. The device is now more valuable than the organs and combined incomes of everyone in. Subject phone down, here. So, you're trying to tell me, Gladys, that this gun is now more valuable than anything that could ever be in my body. Right, because I was really planning on going to an organ donor to sell all my organs for cash. I'm not that desperate for money. Would I love to have more money? Sure. Would I love to sell my organs to obtain it? Not really. And there we go. That's a cool beat. So we've gotten an, our orange portal device now, so we now have control over both portals. And we only have about eight test chambers left to go through, honestly. So we are moving along pretty quickly. So thank you guys for watching. I have been Rupt at. And next time we will continue going through another set of portal, portal chambers. Why did I have to stutter there? And moving on through the rest of the game. As I said, this is a short game, but it still has its charm. Maybe I might show off some of the challenge maps later, now that I think about it. But we'll see when we get there. Right now we need to beat the story. Anyway, I will see you guys then.